Hello, I'm Bailey, and this is Art by Bailey. Today I'm going to be opening a Bob Ross Master Paint Set. This was a gift from a friend for my birthday. Bob is the king of gentle, soft speaking with painting. I think it's a great combination. We are going to pay an homage to Bob today with a soft spoken ASMR unboxing of these things. I just took off the wrapping and flipped it over. And let's see what will be in the box. We have a master paint set instruction manual. What materials are in there? Give some instructions. Oh, and then it changes to Dutch. That's fun. Um, and then French. I'm just curious what other languages. And there's a little notes section in the back. Very nice. I'm going to open this up. This is liquid white oil paint. If it were Bob, he would say white, liquid white. Says the Bob Ross wet on wet painting technique is dependent upon a wet surface to work on. Apply a thin, even coat along horizontal and vertical strokes of liquid white base coat over entire surface using a Bob Ross natural bristle brush. Do not allow the liquid white to dry before you begin painting. Mix well before using and thin only with Bob Ross odorless thinner. Okay, great. I don't, I can't tell if these are metal or not. Yeah, they're metal. This is titanium white. Or white. <laughs> Slap green. Phthalo blue. A 
alizarin crimson such a pretty color cadmium yellow hue this is hue on there I think maybe it says hue because this is pretty opaque I mean, uh, translucent. So maybe that's why they mentioned it's a hue. Bright red. Van Dyke brown. Midnight. This is a Fabra painting knife made in Italy. Fun fact, this is shiny and metal and the one in the Bob Ross um, show was like an opaque black, um, matte black almost. And it's because they didn't want to shine um, the reflections into the camera so they like spray painted it. This is a number six fan blender. This is what makes the happy little trees, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Scooch it out of this casing. Very beautiful. motion for the uh, evergreen trees. The oh so famous two inch brush. Two inch background. This one's made in Germany. Interesting. Look at this little cutie. The script liner, also made in Germany. I think this is what he signs his stuff with. It's kind of tough at the end. I wonder if it's supposed to be like that. No, I think it was just a little bit stuck together. Yeah, it's neat. And the one inch landscape brush. Here we go. Very nice. It's very thick. Brush. Lots of bristles. As compared to some of my other paint brushes, you can see how narrow and thin, kind of chiseled. This one is. Yeah. Difference in quality of the handles too. Because it tapers in, that's pretty nice. Gives you an easy grip. This is fine, works great. I think you might be intended to choke up further back for a smoother swish. But this is a great brush. 
excited to try it. Here, at the back of the box, you can see it has all of the paints we just looked at, and the brushes, and painting knife. And it says Bob Ross Liquid White, Bob Ross Oil Colors, such as Titanium White, Sap Green, Alizarin Crimson, Thalo Blue, Cadmium Yellow, Bright Red, Bandai Green, Midnight Black, and the brushes Bob Ross 2. Ross 2 inch background blush brush, excuse me. Bob Ross 1 inch landscape brush. Bob Ross 6, number 6 fan brush. Bob Ross number 2 script liner. Number 10 painting knife. A full color how to instruction for a mountain summit. Very nice. I think this was a wonderful gift. And I look forward to look forward to playing around with all of the colors. Maybe I will. In this video, give a little swatch. What do you think? Sure, do a little swatch. Place my brushes over here. I don't think I'm going to use these. Just yet. Okay, I'm going to swatch each of these colors, starting with alizarin crimson. These tubes are quite large. I think it's a really great amount so that it's not overwhelming, like you're never going to get through it, but it's not just a little bit either. I have another set of oil paints I did in ASMR style unboxing for those that I got. Oh, that one came out fast. Um, the other paint set I got on Amazon. Uh, my husband bought them for me. They're great. Uh, starter set. But, um, uh, they, they are little tubes and a lot of different colors, whereas these are larger colors, um, which makes it more free to mix your own colors, which is, which is really neat. Next, Van Dyke Brown. Very dark. And compare the color on the tube with this, and it's much darker than I was expecting. I was thinking more chocolate milk. Uh oh. Maybe I should squeezey squeeze. A bit shake it. That one is really oily. A little better. And then our white. Which is kind of more of a vanilla shade than my paper. So I'm just going to use a little brush and just swatch 
point. Shade out. Wow, that little bit of paint really spread far. I don't have any medium going. I'm going to switch brushes. That one got loaded up with paint, and I was going to do a little gradient. I'm dirtying a lot of brushes right now for this, but don't worry, I will clean them. Later. Then I'll make a gray finish. Mixing the black with the white. That's a really nice green. The black is almost a purple undertone. Like, um, eggplant. Eggplant color. Interesting. It made this really beautiful gray tone. Yeah, that was a fun swatch test. I don't have any odorless paint thinner, but I did find when I was using my last my last oil painting session is that um, using a jar full of using a jar full of white vinegar is a good way to go. You can just swish it around in the white vinegar and a lot of, a lot of the color comes off really easily and then you just um, wipe it on a towel and do it again. Pretty simple and you don't need to buy something special if you already have white vinegar on hand. So that was a fun experiment with the new colors. Hope you've enjoyed this unboxing. I sure did. And having my hands on something similar to what Bob would have used is really, really wonderful. Thank you for joining me today for this ASMR video. If you like this video, please let me know down in the comments. And like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this. A wonderful day, and God bless.